ladies, welcome back to another video. It's your girl, Mrs. Emily Paints. And as you guys can tell by the title of this video, we are going to be doing Vlogmas this week. So I just wanted to tell you guys that for this whole month, I'm going to try my best and absolutely try my best because you guys, I suck at staying consistent when it comes to YouTube sometimes. But before I can only like manage to upload two videos per week and this time I'm going to be doing this every single day. So I'm going to try my best to be posting a video every single day for you guys for Vlogmas. Just what I'm doing throughout the day, a lot of Christmassy stuff, a lot of fun stuff. And so yeah, you guys are going to be following me around in my little room <laughs> to the kitchen to make food. And a lot of other daily stuff that I do around here including filming, a lot of fun stuff, talking about Christmas movies, making cookies, um, putting up a tree which is not going to be here, it's going to be at my mom's, Mama Paints' house. So. I just want to come on here and tell you guys that I will be doing Vlogmas this year and it's going to be very consistent and every single day up until, I would say the 25th, but I kind of want to do this up until New Year's. So I'm going to try my best to do this throughout all of December up until January 1st. So follow me along in this adventure. Okay, you guys, the lighting is kind of lame, like it's all over the place. But we are going to be going into the kitchen because I'm going to make some food. I'm not going to be talking too much, but I will be doing a voiceover only because it gets pretty loud because of my roommate's son. And he's probably going to be awake by the time I'm out there. So let's go to the kitchen. Don't mind me while I text my handsome man while he's at work <laughs> before I make some food. This is usually what I like to make for breakfast. I like to cut up some asparagus and I like to put some Cajun seasoning and put some butter in there. Now this sauce that I'm making you guys, I love to make this with some enoki mushrooms. This is like an Asian style sauce you guys. It's kind of spicy-ish but it's also sweet. Super super good but I'm going to show you guys right now what the mushroom look like so you guys can get an idea of what I eat. This is what the mushroom looks like you guys and I'm going to be putting the sauce on top. Oh, I'm loving making this video for you guys because it kind of shows you guys a part of what I do throughout the day sometimes. I'm really just trying to get a better schedule lately because honestly I haven't been eating breakfast the right way. So this is me trying to get back on schedule and you guys are going to be a part of that journey. This is what the mushroom is looking like so far. It's so, so good. And just looking at this while I'm editing is making me hungry all over again, you guys. <sighs> But anyways, after the food, I'm going to do a couple of other things and then we're going to talk about Christmas movies. So you guys better not go anywhere. I also threw in two eggs, you guys, but this is what my plate looks like. Ugh, looks so good. And of course, I have to take out a Christmas mug just for the occasion. <laughs> Excuse my ugly ass hand, you guys. This thing, I can't wait for it to go away. <laughs> I don't even know why it's swollen. It sucks. But anywho, my boyfriend gave me this ice sparkling water and that is what I'm drinking right now and I'm trying this out for the first time. I think this is blackberry. I'm not sure what flavor it was, but it was pretty damn good. <laughs> now bon appetit. Time to eat. Also, while I'm eating all of this good stuff, you guys, I'm watching the novela Teresa. <laughs> I'm sure a lot of you guys know which novela that is, but if you don't, look it up. It's a very, very good. One of my favorites. I just started watching it again today for that 1,000 time. And I can't wait to finish it already. <laughs> Alright ladies, so after all of that, um, I did not record this part of the day. But I did fold some clothes. I did some laundry. I cleaned up the room. As you guys can see, it kind of changed up a little bit back here. <laughs> but now for the final part of this video today, I do want to talk about my favorite movies for Christmas. And I do recommend you guys watch these because, oh my god, they're so good. I'm sure like around two or three of these you guys already know, but one of them, it's this Netflix movie. Oh my god, I'm in love with it. I don't know if you guys have heard of it, but it is called Holiday Date. This is what, the, this is what it looks like. Let me show you guys here. Okay, so you guys, this movie... Oh. The first time I watched it, it made me cry, it made me laugh, it, I was dying, but it's so, so good. I'm only going to tell you guys a little bit about this movie because it's it's pretty good and I want you guys to watch it. So like, look for it. If you have Netflix, look for it, sis. You're going to love it. So in this movie, this girl, I'm just, you know what, I'm going to make it super short because if you guys watch it, I don't want to ruin it for you guys. 
So basically, she looks for a holiday date, which is literally the title of the movie. Um, a guy to be going out with on the holidays only and stuff like that. And so they go through all these adventures and so many things happen and it's so funny and then it's sad and then it's just, it's all over the place. But it's so good and if you guys like those romantic, you know, Christmas movies and stuff, this is it. This is it. But it's funny and I do not recommend you watch this in front of your parents. <laughs> because it's going to be uncomfortable and awkward. But yeah, this movie is really, really good. That's one of my favorite movies for the holidays so far and I only seen it this year so it's gonna be included in every other holiday from here on out. <laughs> but the second movie I wanted to talk to you guys about which is a very 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 popular movie that almost everybody knows about but if you guys don't you need to watch it. It's funny, it's it's like tradition to watch it every single year around Christmas. So I'm sorry if you guys can hear any of the background noise in the back. You can just hear some cars passing. It's never really that loud and it's probably because I always have the windows closed. But today I have them open because I need some fresh air in here. So, <laughs> excuse the noise. Well, this movie, you guys, is called Home Alone, which I know a lot of you guys have heard of. But this is what it looks like. Okay, and this is one of the traditional movies that I love to watch around these days. Ah, it's, it's a freaking awesome movie, you guys. It's funny. I'm not going to kill it for those of you that haven't seen it because I'm sure some of you guys have not. You know, you never know. But um, it's very, very good. It's funny. It's about this little kid that they actually forget at home on their way out on a trip. This big family, which I don't want to give too many details because what if some of you guys haven't seen it? But it's a really good movie and I recommend you guys go and watch it for the holidays. It's going to be fun. And the third one is one that probably everybody has seen, which is obviously called The Grinch. Now, if you haven't seen that movie, come on. You have to have, ha you have, to have seen that movie. Like, it's so good. And it's funny. <laughs> this is what it looks like. And that's one of my favorite movies to watch around this time of year, too. And finally, which is a very, very popular movie, but not this one necessarily. So I'm sure you guys have heard of The Nutcracker, right? Well, there's this movie um, about The Nutcracker, but it's with the Barbie. And that is actually one of my other favorite movies that I've watched since I was a little girl. But I haven't actually seen it in a long time, and I do plan on seeing it. And those of you that follow me on TikTok, you will probably be watching it with me on live. So go follow me on TikTok and Instagram, you guys, and go get updated on everything else that I'm doing, if you haven't already. But this is what the movie looks like. And I know that this movie is a little more on the childish side because it is, you know, Barbie. It is a cartoon, you know, it's not really the typical Nutcracker movie that everybody usually watches. But those are the four favorite movies that I have so far written down for me to watch this month and I would like for you guys to check out too. And yeah, you guys, I'm actually going to start getting ready for the gym because my man's is going to come pick me up. <laughs> so I have to change real quick. I should also be removing my makeup right now, you guys. So I'm probably going to be doing that right now on camera with you guys. Because either way, like... You guys, doing makeup kind of sucks sometimes because then you have to take it off right after like literally right after you do your makeup and your hair and just everything you gotta remove everything and it's annoying because you're like no like i look good i want to go somewhere but yeah guys that's usually what i end up doing right after and of course i'm going with my neutrogena makeup remover towels because that's my favorite and i also use the neutrogena makeup remover liquid which it looks like this. It says it's oil free. Oil free, right? Yeah, oil free. So I'm going to be removing this stuff off of my face. And I'll be taking this thing off too because my arm, you guys, my arm still hurts. I don't really know what happened to it. It's just been swollen and, and it just hurts. But I'm going to have to go to a doctor for that because I really don't know what's wrong with it. So I'm taking this off for now just so I can like move my hand around easier and be able to take all this stuff off. But yeah, anyways, on another note... We are getting close to the end of this video, not yet, but I am going to be filming one every single day from here on out during this month for my Vlogmas videos. 
but i hope you guys enjoy this content because it is exclusive i do not show my daily life every single day only to my tiktok fam sometimes <laughs> but yeah you guys watch this disappear and honestly i'm happy to take this makeup off because red eyeshadow stains your eyes it stains your eyes and i hate it so thank god i'm taking it off right away another thing the palette that i used was morphe mickey and friends it's this new collection that came out. I think it's like limited edition or something. So that's what I used. If you guys want to see the tutorial, go on my Instagram. Go on my Instagram and TikTok or TikTok. It's the same name everywhere. And you guys will be able to watch the tutorial. But I'm going to have to be taking this off. Oh, it comes off so smoothly. I think I might have used too much liquid, you guys. But yeah, I'm just going to take off this makeup real quick and then obviously once I'm done with this, I'm not going to record the rest of my day because I am going to record tomorrow for you guys. But um, meanwhile, I'm just going to take this off and I'm going to tell you guys what is going to happen for the rest of the day today. Originally, I was supposed to be at my mom's house today, you guys. I was supposed to go to my mom's. I was supposed to put up the Christmas tree and do all that fun stuff. But for whatever reason, Mama Paints did not pick me up. She woke up late. And I was like, ah, because as a lot of you guys may know, those of you that follow me on other social media platforms, I'm trying to get a car. I don't have one right now. So my mom was not able to pick me up. So I wasn't able to go put the Christmas tree, but she said she will be picking me up tomorrow. So I'm excited for that because me and my cousin Lily, which just came from Mexico, we are going to be posting that video together, filming together, and we're going to be putting up the tree. So I'm very, very excited for that. Okay, you guys, my eyes are burning. <laughs> it's such a struggle every time I'm trying to take my makeup off. Like, my eyes are so sensitive sometimes. I mean, it's at random times too. Like, it's annoying. You know, these are probably like the best makeup remover towels I've like ever ever used. Even if sometimes they feel oily and weird, they're like the best ones I've used on my face. Like they take everything off, everything, everything. Like you can come home from a late night, you know, going out, partying or whatever you're doing. And just grab one of these and just go and it'll all come off <laughs> so quick and you'll feel so good. Although, I'm going to be honest, there are times when I do not go to sleep without my makeup. Like, I keep it on. Like, I keep it on, I don't take it off. And that's not good, I know it's not good. Alright, looks like it didn't stain my eyes, which that is a good sign from this palette, you guys. Because I hate when they do that. Like, I hate when they stain your face. And honestly, you guys, right now that I'm going to go to the gym, I'm mainly just going to support my boyfriend because um, I can't work out right now. Like, I can't really do a lot of exercise because of my PCOS. If a lot of you guys didn't know, I have PCOS. So every time I work out, I can hurt myself. And I did it the other day, so I've been trying to stop my bleeding for a while now. And it has not been working. So here we are going to the gym just to walk slowly because I can't really work out like that. Well, let me change. I'll be right back. Don't go nowhere. Hang on. All right, you guys, I'm all dressed for the gym. I'm going to show you guys what I'm wearing. Let me just go back. Oh, look, here's my water bottle, you guys. All right, let me show you guys. It's just this little purple shirt. And then it's like this camel, these camel pants, which feel super, super tight. And they're actually from Walmart, and they're so comfortable. My boyfriend bought them for me. Super comfortable. Super, super comfortable. But I am ready, you guys. I'm just going to put my hair up in a pointy tail. Let me look for a rubber band. Okay, you guys, my hair is up. I am ready. Um, these little bangs are staying down today. And the only reason why I actually let them down is because I'm not gonna really be working out. I'm just gonna be walking. So it's not gonna be like a big, big workout where I'm gonna be like running and you know, my hair is gonna get all over the place because I can't. So this will do. Um, this is everything for today, you guys. I will be coming on here again tomorrow to vlog for you guys and be putting up my Christmas tree and my mom's house, of course, because nothing fits here. This room is so small. So I will be back tomorrow to show you guys the Christmas tree and everything else if I have anything else planned for tomorrow. And yeah, you guys, that is all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to comment below, like this video, and subscribe if you haven't so you guys can keep up with my everyday Christmas vlogs from now on during this month <laughs> so yeah you guys i'll see you guys in my next video bye